Nearly two years on from the murder of one and a half year old Khan Kakama, the verdict has been passed amidst high emotions. Twenty-three year old Melo Nambasa and twenty-four year old Brian Sajabi will both spend fifty years behind bars after being convicted of both kidnap and murder. In her ruling, Justice Faith Monda said that prosecution provided overwhelming evidence implicating Melon Nambasa, the maid who handled Lito Kakoma to Brian Sajabi, also an accomplice in the murder, not only for kidnap, but also for murder too. She also ruled that Brian Sajabi and his partner Gordon Tumusime's intention in kidnapping Kakama was to murder him and not seeking a ransom payment. The High Court judge also said that there's evidence showing that although the two received a ransom of one million shillings from Naomi, Kakoma's mother, they put the baby in a polythene bag, suffocating him to death. Yet after Kakama's death, they continued to ask for another ransom of 30 million shillings, which was also delivered to them. The judge also pointed out that Brian Sajabi led the police to where they threw Kakama's body. Justice Monda concluded that the two had not demonstrated any remorse through the lengthy court proceedings. Justice has been done and the two accomplices indicted in the murder of one and a half year old Kam Kakama will be spending 50 years in prison. But the memories of the brutal murder of Naume and Stephen's little boy cannot only be taken away by time, but as Naume said, we'll take the grace of God. Solomon Serwanja, NTV.